Ho, 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 it's Legal Claws coming to you from uh, the North Pole. And I uh, wanted to talk about something that came to mind this morning and that was, we've really been concentrating on. You know, we come to the holiday season, you hear everybody saying, oh, man, it's like, uh, you know, there's, there's, you know, Santa Claus is going to rob you. It's like, you know, Santa Claus. And I've even said as a service-based business, as an attorney, um, you know, at Santa Claus, people are, I'm sorry, at Christmas, people are worried about paying Santa Claus or worried about... Uh, you know, being with loved ones, doing things that are that are valid things, they're good things, but not worried about paying their attorney, not worried about paying their legal bills. Well, you know, what comes to mind really is jujitsu here. Jujitsu is, you know, a martial art where one of the main things you're doing, you're fighting a bigger, stronger opponent, somebody's really aggressive, is simply taking their actions, their weight, their movements, their momentum, and using it against them or going with the flow. Okay, and the flow this time of year is more retail discounts. People are actually people have their credit cards and their pocketbooks out and are ready to spend money, right? They want to spend money. In fact, if you look at the actual industry uh, of retail, the majority of all retail makes their all their money in the last quarter of the year. They make you know eighty percent plus of their money in twenty percent of the year, which is perfectly fits into Pareto's principle, that 80-20 rule, the rule of efficiency. And and that's great. So they can pretty much hibernate throughout the year and expend all their energy in marketing and hammering you in the last quarter of the year. So how can we, as service-based businesses, capture that momentum? Get in the sleigh with Santa Claus. You know, ride that momentum and 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 end up with more money in our pockets right at the end of the year. My thoughts are, one, people are going to be with family members around the holidays, right? You're competing with the turkey, you're competing with Santa Claus. I'd like to change that mentality. You're really not competing with them. And let's stop the competition mentality. How can you use what's already there in the system? How can you use Santa Claus? How can you use the turkey? Well, my thoughts are, and not just mine, but some other people in my company and in my industry, uh, I've been talking about it, thinking about it. Um, well, you know, families are going to be together around the holidays. So number one, you know, you could tailor all your social media messaging, your blogs, your posts, uh, film a holiday commercial. That's what we just did. Tailored specifically to getting with family on the holidays, talking about the tough things that matter, right? Talking about the things that really um you need to talk about with mom and dad in my industry, in estate planning and elder law. Let's talk about how to save your hard-earned money and property while we're here, while the sister's here from Sacramento, while the daughter's here from Dayton, right? While the brother's here from Boise, while they all flew in, let's talk at the dinner table around the turkey about the things that matter. Let's talk about capitalizing on that momentum on the family coming in. Let's address the important things, not just the frivolous and material things. You can always get mom or dad a tie, or a, I don't know if mom wears a tie or not, but you can give mom some pajamas, right? Or a sweater. But what's better than ties and a sweater? McIntyre Elder Law, right? Legal clause, the Elder Law guy. I mean, you could spin it. You could spin those things and really capitalize and do some holiday jujitsu and capitalize on that momentum. Same thing with Christmas. My thoughts are, you know, have extended ho holiday hours. Be willing to work, to put in the hours, to show up, to meet people on Christmas Eve if they need to. Man, I've certainly people are out there working in retail on Black Friday, on Thanksgiving night, all in the wee hours of the morning, you know, around Christmas, selling to the last minute. Can you capitalize that on that in a service-based business, especially, say, an attorney? I think you can. I think you could have extended hours. Um, you could offer holiday specials, just thinking about that. I'm not a huge fan of holiday specials. I think the, the retail industry actually makes somewhat of a mistake by training customers that they can simply wait till the end of the year to buy things at you know, really, really deeply discounted prices. I don't want to train my clients to simply buy things at deeply discounted prices. However, um, you know, perhaps I could offer 
the quality, offer the message, uh, say this is a great time to get in. What they do on Black Friday sales is, you know, they'll offer one item way deep, very deep in the store for a really discounted price. You know, like a huge 60 inch TV set for $74.99, $59.99. And then everybody has to go through the entire store to get to it and fight over it. Then whoever wins, you know, this big wrestling brawl, um, you know, wins the TV, um, you know, gets to the TV or gets arrested or something. And, uh, and, you know, by doing that, they, you know, maybe the rest of the things in the store are the things that matter that they're making money off of are regular price, or maybe they've jacked up the prices on those things. I don't know. Could we employ as a company or as a law firm, a similar strategy, um, to maybe offer one thing at a discounted price around the holidays? Maybe. And I'm mulling that over. Although I'm not a huge fan of discounts because I don't want to train my clients to only come to me or to wait to do their estate planning at the end of the year because my employees have to get paid all year and my kids have to eat all year. So, um, so those are some thoughts as well. Um, I've got a holiday jingle. I've got a holiday commercial we filmed. Um, you know, there's tons of ideas and I'm always open to more. Hey, if you have any more ideas that you want to give uh, me uh, and others to help with our idea of holiday jujitsu and using the momentum of the season and the holidays to actually capitalize on the same way the retail business does and make more money at, in the holiday season. And certainly the training and your employees having that message is part of that. Um, give me a call. 704-749-9244 um, or email me at greg, G-R-E-G, at mcelderlaw.com, okay? mcelderlaw.com. Have a great day. Have a happy holidays and stay warm, stay safe, and don't eat too much turkey or something or do. I don't care. Peace.